The Dallas Car Show just opened for the day and on my way in, someone bought a card off me for 500 bucks. So I'm not gonna take this 500 bucks and hunt the show floor for some nice deals before the show gets too busy. You got some nice stuff here. Can I see that? Um, let me see that Khalil Mack booklet there. That's one I've not seen before. That's a pretty sharp looking booklet. Khalil Mack, one of the best defenders in the league, rookie card. Uh, rookie patch auto that's uh, you know pretty sweet with a booklet design it's got kind of a neat uh, 3d design there shadow box design to that card you're asking a hundred on that would you take would you take 70 for it how about 80 80 how about 75 75 for uh, in the picture is it? 75 in a picture okay 75 in a picture is fine there you go so what I'm looking for this morning are cards that are really unique. Cards you don't see every day, but cards that have a lot of eye appeal. This one definitely fits the bill. The reason why I'm looking for this is I'm going live Tuesday night on Whatnot. And every card I pick up right now, I will be selling Tuesday night at 10.30 p.m. Eastern time on our Sports Card Investor channel on Whatnot. So I'm gonna pick up some great cards and you could potentially buy any of these. If you don't have the Whatnot app yet, scan that QR code. We're gonna pop it up on the screen right now. And, or you can click the link in the show description below and we'll give you $10 in free credit that you can use towards our live stream Tuesday, 10.30 p.m. Eastern time. I have a price on, on that DeAndre Swift. 50 bucks. Okay. And then what about uh, the Michael Burst Magic? Like 20 bucks. What do you take both for 60? Sure, why not? Do it? Sure. Okay, so a couple more unique cards, nice values you don't see every day. Little uh, Michael Jordan Magic Johnson card, inexpensive card. Uh, picked that up for under 20 bucks, but uh, you know, cool card, reminiscent of the 90s. And then, you know, DeAndre Swift's got a new team this year. He's gonna be a new guy in Philly, and I like Philly a lot. I like the Eagles' chances this season. So that's why I picked that one up. I think DeAndre Swift's gonna have himself a lot, nice spotlight in Philly this fall. So this is a nice case. They got a lot of raw vintage, inexpensively priced. Looks like some uh, nice prices here on cards that kind of pull me back to, to my childhood. Some of these cards were pre-me, but I remember people having a lot of these at card shows when I was a kid. Could I see the Cal Ripken? Let me do the Pete Rose. Let me do that Roberto Clemente. You got Frank Robinson and Hank Aaron. I've seen these before. These were part of uh, a game, right? From 1969? Right. So it's basically a baseball game where you use the cards mm -hmm. and they had a whole bunch of the different uh, MLB stars from that era in these cards. Right. 15, 30, 40, 60, 75. What do you do the, what do you do the whole lot of those for 60? Yeah. Awesome. Sure. Thank you very much. Yeah. I wanted to pick up some vintage baseball to mix that into my live stream. I got some nice ones. That's Cal Ripken Jr.'s rookie card uh, from Donruss, 1982. This is a card that I was chasing when I was a kid. And you got a, a later career Pete Rose card, but any Pete Rose is awesome. And then I think these are real cool. These 1969 game cards, just a little piece of baseball history here with some of the all time greatest players. These are nice inexpensive cards, but these are gonna be fun ones to sell in my whatnot. That's not a real auto, is that? Is that a facsimile auto? No, that's a, it's an auto. Is that a real auto? Yeah, it's out of the honors, so it's got the stamp. Okay. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Numbered out of 30. Okay, so this is one of the buyback products. But that's an actual real Barry Sanders auto. Yeah. That's real cool. Number to 30 on an old prestige card from 2000. Wow. That's not something you see every day. Would you be willing to do 80 on it? I want 90. 90? Yeah, I'll do 90 on it. That's fine. Thank you. Appreciate Thank it. You. Thank you. Yep. So that's a cool card you don't see every day. That's a Barry Sanders on-card auto from uh, Prestige from 2000. It's number to 30 because it was part of a, a buyback from the Honors Panini Honors buyback. So I thought that was a real cool one. You can't go wrong with a Barry Sanders auto. You're talking one of the greatest running backs of all time. Scan this one in Market Movers. Love this card. 
So Market Mover shows the last sale of this at 185. Uh, would you take 170? Sure. Yeah, awesome, perfect. Let's do that, thank you. That's one of my absolute favorite Kobe Bryant cards. And the reason why is the angel wing design around him. I think it's just, I think it's a touching card. Obviously we know Kobe is in the heavens up above right now. And this card from 2012 Crusade is uh, really symbolic of that. You don't see these too often in PSA 10 Gen Mint. So this was one I definitely wanted to pick up for my audience on my whatnot stream. All right, so only $45 remaining, maybe enough for one or maybe two final cards. Can I see that that Peyton Manning card? That's pretty sweet. Uh, yeah. Pop Look at that. Pop. Something you don't see every day. Cool year. <laughs> yeah. That's really neat. A Pop One 2015 Tops High Tech uh, PSA 10 Peyton, Peyton Manning Spiral card. I love those acetate cards with the cool designs. Those are uh, that's pretty sweet right there. And that's the year he won the Super Bowl with the Broncos. So that's kind of a special card. This might be what we end it with. I've only got 45 bucks though. That's marked at 50. Let's see if we'll take it or not. Would you take uh, 45 on that? Yeah, I got you. Awesome. There you go. Thank you. Absolutely appreciate it. So I'm wrapping up today here at the Market Movers booth at the Dallas Card Show. How do you guys think I did? All of these cards for 500 bucks, you think I got a good value? And out of these, which is your favorite? Let me know in the comments below and then join me this Tuesday, 10.30 p.m. Eastern time on the Sports Card Investor channel on Whatnot. And if you don't have that Whatnot app yet, scan that QR code on your screen or click the link in the show description below. You'll get $10 in free credit that you can use towards our live stream 10.30 p.m. Eastern time this Tuesday on Whatnot. I'll see you there.